My name is Kimberly Jones. I was born in Coleman, Texas, but I've spent the majority of my life in Sweetwater, Texas, which is the home of the world's largest rattlesnake roundup. And yes, those are snakes. This is where I live now. When I was in high school, I took several dual credit classes, so I graduated high school as a college sophomore. After high school, I attended Howard College in Big Spring for a year, and then transferred to ASU. This is my first year at ASU and I love it. My major is ECH through 6 Generalist with Special Ed. Three words that describe me are bubbly, honest, and persistent. I always try to keep a positive and upbeat attitude and I love to laugh. This is why I describe myself as bubbly. I'm also an honest person. What you see is what you get. I'm pretty straightforward. A final word that I will describe myself as is persistent. Many times throughout my college education I've wanted to throw in the towel and just give up. But I keep something on my mind and it always helps me to keep on keeping on. I was fortunate enough to be a long term sub for a kindergarten class. I was their full time teacher for four months and I fell in love with them. I was heartbroken when a certified teacher took over. This is why I'm so persistent with my education. I know that after I put in all the hard work, my efforts will pay off and I will be back in a classroom with my own students. I am lucky enough to have three parents. My mom's name is Tina Walker, my dad's name is Alan Windham, and my stepmom's name is Stormy Windham. My mom has always been a wonderful influence on me. She raised four kids as a single mother, working full time to provide for us. And she did more than that. I had a great childhood and I'm grateful for the hard work she did. She taught me not only how to be a great mother, but also how to be a worker and to always be thankful for what's given to me. I'm married to an awesome guy. His name is Chris and we've been married since April 2009. We met at our church where he is the music minister and I teach children's church. He motivates me to do well. He supports me in my education and he encourages me when things get rough, like around finals time. We don't have any kids yet, but what I want out of life is to eventually have a family, to be a fantastic mother and wife, and to touch the life of every student that I will ever work with in my career.